This is the uh, SPX Flow 1000 per gallon per hour uh, 12 volt uh, bilge pump. And this is the float switch to it. Now the problem I have with this float switch is that it was too sensitive. Um, basically, you put it in, you put it in and the adjustment was too high uh, and then it would turn on and then I'd bring it down and then as I'm driving the boat it would shake and then it would turn on and it wouldn't turn off okay um, so basically the way the float switch works is just a, um, a magnet in here it's a magnet in here and as it goes high enough in here it uh, hits a switch here it causes an internal switch to to turn on so basically to fix this really easy is to make this magnet instead of ride that high you need it to readjust it so it rides even lower now in order to do that <clears throat> you just have a hole here there's two holes here let's see where that right there so you can see where i drilled the second hole so the first hole was here, right there, and it was too high. So I just re-drilled the hole a little bit lower so the magnetic switch drops down further so it doesn't uh, turn on as sensitively. Okay, so right about there. Maybe a little bit higher. So you can see right there. See, So you can see the switch there and this screw will hold that switch from dropping down. So I just took out the screw, I re-drilled it, and now it's gonna ride a little bit lower and it won't be so sensitive to turn on. So as it goes up, it turns on, because it, it floats up, and when it pumps out, it drops down, and it stops. But if it's too sensitive, right here between off and on, it will stay on when you don't want it to. And so just re-drill the hole and drop it a little bit further and you'll be all set. That's it.